Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new save file. I don't know what we're going to call this anymore, but we're going to jump in and do another run as the Tarnished Lost. I'm not going to play this character for every episode forever, but we're going to do another run of him because I quite enjoyed the last one. It seemed that you guys did as well, so why not give it another go and see if we can best this beastly character. Um, very interesting character indeed. We'll take the Plasma Globe off the bat. Um, and as for the question of the day, what's a game that you are thoroughly enjoying at the moment? This, it ties into a few things for me. So for me, Hades 2. I've just started playing it today. It came out kind of last night. Um, and oh my god, it's so goddamn good. And my tie-in is I just uploaded an episode on it earlier today for you guys. It'll be earlier today. Please, please, please go and check it out because I'll be honest... I'm a I'm at a bit of a bit of a shit spot with YouTube at the moment, and it's getting me down. <laughs> um, and I really, really, really want Hades 2 to be a series that I can make a bit more of a mainstay of the channel because I really enjoy it, and I hope people will too. I think it's a good game for viewing. Um, I think it's a fun game to watch, and yeah, I'm just really enjoying it as well. Um, and I'd love to be able to do it a, a, like a good couple of times a week and, and enjoy it myself and how other people enjoy it too. So it'd be lovely if people could go and check that out and see if it's their sort of thing, see if they want to enjoy it. Because yeah, I'll be honest people, I'll be honest, I am in, I am in a, a bit of a YouTube rut at the moment and it's getting me down majorly. Um, it's sad, I really hope I it's not something that lasts, but I don't know, I just... I had two days in a row where I didn't do any Isaac, um, and it was, it was, first one was because it was my sort of regular day off, the second one was I didn't have a backlog video and I just genuinely didn't end up having the time to, um, to make one. And I was like, oh well, I'm, I'm taking a break from Isaac at the minute, I, it's fine, I don't, I've got to pressure myself to do it. And uh, the videos I uploaded got like a hundred views, and it's like, I, I, I wanna be, I wanna not care about views, I really wanna not care about views, but goddamn. That bummed me out massively. <laughs> when you go from getting like a thousand views on an Isaac video or a Risk of Rain video to putting out three videos and them all getting barely a hundred views, it's just like, ugh. It's 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 sad times, man. It's sad times. And it was it was just kind of defeating to see. And then I put out Hades and it's doing decent, but it's not doing as well as I'd have hoped, and it's just like, ah oh, man. I really, really want it to go well because I want it to be something that I can bring back to the channel and people, like a good amount of people, enjoy. Um, so I'm, I'm really, really hoping that it can, it can go that way. Honestly, I'll take speed as well. I'm really, really hoping it can go that way and I can, I can make it something that everyone can enjoy and I can enjoy a lot. Um, but yeah, I don't know. YouTube's just been really putting me in a, in a bad mood recently, and I, it re realistically, I shouldn't let it get to me. It's like if I'm enjoying it, that's all I should, that, that's all that should matter. But like. I just don't like it when, like, I go from, like, getting a good amount of views in a video and having a lot of people enjoy it and seeing a lot of comments to being, like, the complete polar opposite. And it just makes me regret my choices to, to slow down my Isaac. I should have just stuck with it and, de like, dealt with it for a bit. <laughs> I should have just stuck with it and, and yeah, d dealt with it because I don't want it... Oh, God, I forgot they jumped. Um, Because, yeah, I don't want it to get to the point where... Uh, do you know what? I'll, I'll pop this. Why not? Um, where, because I'm not doing Isaac, people aren't checking my channel anymore, and then nothing does well. It's just like, ugh. I put myself in a bad spot by doing so much Isaac. People, people only wanted Isaac, and now the people that aren't getting Isaac aren't watching as much, and so they're not seeing the new stuff, so the new stuff isn't doing too hot, and it's just like, ugh. It's this self-fulfilling prophecy, and I'm sure you guys don't want to sit here and listen to me rant about, woe is me, my, oh, my game just crashed. Great. Right, one moment. Okay, we are back in this. We are back. Let's go again. We're gonna have to fight this boss again, which I'm I'm not too jazzed about, I'll be honest. I'm not too jazzed about. But I think I can maybe Can I can I do this? This is really, really risky, but I'm, I'm gonna see if I can do this. If I if I pop my remnants now and then kill you, do I get like uber charges off of you because you're a boss, or does that only work with the actual boss? That only works with the actual boss, so what I've done here is I put myself in a position where I could very, very easily die. So I'm a little miffed that I've uh, that I've done that to myself, but let's just play it out and see how it goes. Play it out and see how it goes. We might be able to kill this guy pretty darn quickly, to be honest. Oh god, the jumping! The jumping! I forgot about the jumping! Oh lord. Wait, what? Why didn't it just auto-restart? Excuse me. There you go. 
Bit of a shame there. Bit of a shame to lose that. I was really liking that uh, that plasma orb as well. That plasma orb was doing us some real good. Just gonna wait for you to do your thing. Yeah, plasma orb was doing us some real good. It's a, it's a shame to see it go, but I the game had to crash and force me to do things differently, and I had to try something new, didn't I? I had to. <laughs> but yeah, as I was saying, like I, I, I'm sure you guys don't just want to sit here and listen to me ranting on and on about like my YouTube foibles, but I'm just trying to navigate this situation at the moment, and I don't know. I'm not doing it very well in terms of mentally. I'm not handling it the best. It's 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 a difficult time. It's a difficult time for me. Um, just it's it, it's all like really sort of first world problem sort of thing. It's not it's not really that big of an issue. Like at the end of the day, as long as someone's watching, I'm happy enough. Um, I just want to make sure I'm doing the best I can, and 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 people are seeing it. And it can always be a bit frustrating when you see uh, you see someone else that you know put out a video on the same game on the day of release and they get like five million times more views than you do for no ooh, what's this no explicable reason use a book to save it into the bookmark use a different active item to also use the save book special charge timed interesting so basically if we use a book it gets saved to the trinket then any other active we use will also use the book too that seems pretty unique. It seems pretty cool. I'm uh, I'm down to clown with that. I'm going to go straight for the boss here and see how we do. And I'm going to do my uh going to do my old divine remnants trick at the end. We'll see if we can actually kill him first. That helps. And then I can just pop this now and this should give me a full charge, I think. It didn't. It didn't. Okay. We'll go back anyways. Right. Oh, <sighs> yeah. I just had to had to run a little bit, and I, I like I said, I'm just I'm just hoping that I can uh, I can find my way back. And if that if that ends up being going back to Daily Isaac after a bit of a break, then that's that might be what I do. I just want to sort of figure out what's going to be best, really. Uh, Slick Spade, very good for us here. I want to figure out what's going to be best, and I I'm I'm unsure what that is. I think what I need to do is I need to make a more rigid um, more rigid upload schedule of what goes out when, and I need to then create some backlogs of current series to allow those to um, to sort of thrive. But I think, I think, I'll be honest, I know some of you enjoy it, but I think Slay the Spire and Balotra are not going to be lasting, because they just did extremely poorly on the channel. Like, like, an unbelievably, unbelievably poorly. Even though I really like Balotra, Balotra, Slay the Spire I do enjoy as well, I would like to do more, more of that, but Balotra was the one that I was really expecting to do pretty well, because I'd had so many requests to play it, and yeah, it just, it just kind of face-planted pretty hard. Um, so that's, that's not ideal. Um, <laughs> not ideal at all. So that, that, those series I'm probably not going to do, but people said I did a poll asking people what they want to see from me, and pe pretty much everyone was saying they want to see new stuff, so I'm hoping that, um, Hades 2 is kind of filling that uh, filling that space of new stuff, and we can, uh, ooh, very nice, uh, we can see some success there, I'm hoping. I, I'd, I'd really like to see it, oh my lord, that was kind of close. I'd really like to see it um, get like 400 to 600 views on the first episode. Probably not very realistic, I, I'm, I'm reckoning it's going to get closer to about 300, if I was to guess. Um... But yeah, and we'll see how this Isaac episode does as well. Um, what I'm ho really hoping is that having taken a two-day break from Isaac, that this Isaac episode doesn't then doesn't then get lost in the weeds for people because I've taken a few days break. I'm hoping that people still see this and still wanna still wanna watch it. I'll, I'll take that and kill the boss with it. Why not? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm hoping people still wanna see this. You know what? I said that. Now I regret my decision because I'm gonna go and blow all this up. Thank God we can fly. There's a lot of stuff here we wouldn't be able to grab if not. We are looking good money-wise. In fact, I'm going to go scoot back all the way to our shop here because I think that's going to be pretty valuable for us at this stage. Uh, what's this? Shopkeepers can be hired. Ooh, eh, I'm, not, I'm not too interested in that, to be honest. The little baby, though, I quite like him. I quite like him. He is good. But yes, yeah, sort of just to get back to my main point, I have just been really, really, really enjoying... Um, Hades 2. I actually really enjoyed the first game. I played it on the channel a good bit, um, and and I, and I thoroughly enjoyed uh, playing it on the channel. I just enjoyed it as a game. I went back to it a, a good few times, and um, ooh, we'll take sibling rivalry as well. 
um, a good few times I, I went back to it and really, really enjoyed it. So I, I'm really happy to see the second ones come out in early access. And as well, like, the early access is, like, absolutely amazing. Like, there's so much content for an early access game. It's kind of, it's kind of wild, really. I did not expect it in early access to have quite as much as it currently does. It's, it's, it's very surprising and, and really, really nice to see. So... A very welcome and pleasant surprise that I was not expecting to have dropped um, yesterday. I really didn't expect it to come out. I thought we were going to be at least at least another month off of early access, really. But uh, we, we got it very, very soon. And yeah, very, very nice to see. Oh, Slick Spade, you absolute beautiful beast. So, so nice. Unfortunately, that item isn't so good for us. We'll check out a devil deal here. Um, no, that's just Rotten Baby. It's just a respray of Rotten Baby. We've got a lot of familiars jotting around with us right now, which is nice. That's very good. Honestly, I'm going to take that over the Bible thing, even though the Bible thing's kind of cooler. And I'm going to do this, and we get damage out of that. Very nice. And we even got some charge out of that there as well. Good stuff. Although we only got two pips out of that, which I'm surprised by. I thought charge key would have just full charged us there. But oh well. But yeah, we've got some good stuff here so far. Some very good stuff indeed. Um, random items at this stage. We'll see what we get. Bob's Curse. I probably would have re-rolled that typically. But Bob's Curse is not bad for us at all. Not bad for us at all. But yeah, if, if people have, like, sort of suggestions of what to do in terms of YouTube, in terms of, like, where I should go next and how I should sort of play things, be interesting to, to sort of figure that out. I'm, I'm going to speak to a few of my friends as well, like Alexa and stuff, and see what they have to say. I think it all just is, like chance really it's it's all just look at the drawer and, and and hoping you can catch the algorithm's eye sort of thing um and I'm, I'm hoping that that i can do that i mean i've sort of changed up my thumbnail style a little bit recently um to things that were more popular back in the day will this kill us it will break our uh it will break that i was unaware that would be the case but interesting to know you guys are gonna have to stop throwing up bigly but yeah, we are now very low on charge on that, which is a little scary, but I think we can hack it. Tears up. Very, very nice. Shot speed down don't mean nothing to me. Do not mind it. Or range down. Not what I wanted, but range isn't awful. It's not It's not the worst. We'll take a random golden card. Golden card is using random cards, right? It uses two random cards, which I feel could be extremely dangerous for us. We did just use Worship there, but it didn't kill us, surprisingly. I thought Worship would have killed us there. So yeah, incredibly dangerous, but also incredibly fun, so... We'll keep it around. We'll, we'll, we'll see what we can make work with it. And we'll uh, take on our boss in rather unfortunate circumstances here. I'm not super enthused how this is going to go, but we'll see. He's slowing down. The slowing down is quite nice. I'm not liking the insane spread of tears you got going on there, my guy. I mean, we've actually destroyed this guy pretty quickly here. I'm just hoping we can finish him off swiftly. There you go. We get perfection, which... Will we take perfection? Yeah, I think we will. I think we will. We don't have anything that really uses it right now, but I think it's, it's very worthwhile. Let's keep on moving down. We got very close to a win with this character previously, but we were wrongfully killed by a blood donation machine because of the beautiful item that is known to be um, Booster Box. It did some very, very uh, annoying things here. More penny types. We like it. Yeah, would, would definitely prefer a little higher range here because I am having to get a little bit close to enemies I'd rather not get close to. We can make it work, though. Right, see what a double card thing does in here? There. <laughs> oh, we got a holy mantle. <laughs> Unexpected. That's a real holy mantle, not a H bar, HP bar holy mantle, that. Do you want to chill out, my guy? There you go. But yeah, Temperance, don't you dare do it again. <laughs> I was just blasting you to high heavens about how you did that to me in the past, so don't you try and pull your dirty tricks on me once more. I will have words. There will be words to be had. 
Yeah, I think another thing about, like, why people are so drawn to, like, Isaac as a series, as a game, not just by me, by anyone, but also on my channel, is that obviously it is just more casual commentary and, like, easy watching, whereas a lot more of the other games are a lot more active in, in what you watch when you watch them, and what you do when you watch them sort of thing, like, you're more paying attention to what's going on. And that isn't always something people can commit to, especially for, like, 45 minutes. A lot of people that listen to these videos are listening to them while they're doing chores, while they're doing homework, sometimes when they're going to bed. So I, I understand that, um... That, like, other series are not always going to do as well because of that. But I'd like to find ways to, to help with that. I think I think Nuclear Throne's hit and hit that nice happy medium. I think I've got a, a pretty good following with the Nuclear Throne videos. And I, I think that's not going to go away anytime soon. I think I've actually done a pretty good job at, like, kind of cornering the market, so to say. Um, I'll re-roll that. Yes, please. Considering we've got a Holy Mantle to spare right now, I'm, I'm pretty happy to use my active item until we lose it. Um... Yeah, I think I've done a pretty good job with the, the Nuclear Throne community, and I don't think those viewers are going anywhere anytime soon. But yeah, I just want to try and find better ways to engage with new viewers. Because my subscriber count, it, 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 grows, it grows steadily, but it grows pretty slowly. I think my best way is going to be making, like, different types of edited videos, but I really, I don't know how to really engage with that properly. I don't know how to get into that. And But I would, I would like to try, though. I would like to try. And just sort of see as an experiment how it does. Oh, that was very nice, and we got our Divine Remnant back as well. Yeah, I think it's something I've just got to experiment with and see see sort of what works. I just used one card that time. Maybe it's one or two that it uses. Ooh, you are very, very bl bright blue there. Weird. I'll pop that again. Better kick. Interesting enough. And we got Inner Demon. That's an active item. In the first six minutes of... Within the uh, six minutes of the first use of this item, the player must clear 24 rooms to obtain two Devil items and two Black Heart. Subsequent use of this item deals full heart damage to the player and increases... If the player was unable to clear 24 rooms, then three random cases are added. For the first six minute use timer. After first use, six minute timer runs regardless whether the player has the item or not. Okay, so let's uh let's grab that, use it, and let's go. We got a buggy woogie. I realized I didn't go to my item room that floor. <laughs> but this item uh, has kind of sped me up a little bit, I'll be honest. So we gotta clear 24 rooms. I think we can do that. Oh my god, that's a lot of money. Very good, very nice. What the hell is that? Purgatory. Okay. Wasn't planning on being here, but... Okay. Um, Clear rune? Yeah, we'll, we'll take a clear rune, why not? Clear rune void, okay. Spolunker's hat, yes please. Oh, I'm still gonna have to fight this, am I? Okay, fair enough. <laughs> fair enough, game, fair enough. I'm hoping these count as cleared rooms. I don't actually know if they will. Okay, don't you be firing your bombs at me, please. No thank you. Yeah, damn. No, thank you. I want that, please. Ooh, I don't think the Baleful Heart will actually do anything for us, unfortunately, but it's nice to have nonetheless. I'm pretty sure these Black Runes can do full room damage. I don't know what their charge is, though, on them. Oh, we got a Planetarium. Oh, four room charge. That's kind of good. Planetarium, of course, it's fucking Mars. Venus isn't much better. I'm just gonna eh, no. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna recharge my active and go for another another pull on that. I think Venus isn't that good. Glitter bombs. The time is not that important. I think we'll be able to make it pretty easily, regardless. Let's not worry too much about that, shall we? Okay. Got a cracked key there as well. I don't think that's really going to do much for us. Right. 
And back we go. Okay. Divine Remnants, do not let me down. Do not let me down. Look down. That lets me down. Come on. S Fuck you, soul. <laughs> I am playing that again. Literally. How dare you, game? How dare you give me such pants, poopy stuff? We can get another charge. We can go again. I will not be besmirched. At the minute the game is very much heavily trying to besmirch me. Don't, don't run away. Okay. One more room. I'm gonna go back again. Ooh, that was kind of close with that. With the swiftness of that. Okay. You give me one more reroll, baby. And it better be good. It goddamn better be good. I will be miffed if I get anything other than the, the toppest of qualities here. Damage down. Damage up every second in hostile rooms. Caps at plus 20. Damage resets when entering a new hostile room. Okay. Interesting. I guess for long boss fights, that could be good. I'm going to give it a go. I don't like the idea of a damage down, but it's not a huge damage down. So I think it can be offset pretty easily. Good. We've got three little wispies here. Okay. Oh, great. Just created a fucking troll bomb on me. It's what every young fella wants. Shop, what can you yield for me? I do like that. Nun's Habit, unfortunately. Not the best of items for us, really, I wouldn't say. Honestly, I can't even be asked to grab that key. Okay, good. I'm glad he was taken care of quickly. I was about to be a bit worried about him. I think we do. I think we do have a, a thingy heart, you know, um, because we're getting multiple purgatory ghosts, which we wouldn't normally get. Why did I go in here? Okay, good. Everything seemed to just die there. I can't get through there now, though. Damn it! 130 seconds to do. God knows how many rooms left. I have no idea. Happy birthday, Lost. Hell yes. We got little, uh, little portal here for a hot second. Obviously, everyone hates that. But luckily, Big Bad Boss is dead. We got a bunch of random bits. I don't really know what that's for. Jesus Juice, rather nice. What are these? What are these pieces? What's all this? I do not know what these pieces are. Are these pieces of our active item or something? What's going on here? Barra Soap, I don't know why I even bothered to take that, to be honest. I should have just black ruined it. Okay. Keep going with these guys, though. Yeah, this was a, this was a bit of a, a wasteful boss fight, if I've ever done seen one. I don't even really know this boss very well at all. Okay, I know I'm well enough to know to stick stick in the middle, apparently. Okay. Not too bad. Not too bad. Should go grab that. 58 seconds. I do not know how many rooms we have remaining that we have to complete. I'm a little worried about that. That's not a lot of time. We do have an insta-kill of a lot of rooms here, so... Great. As if we get this. Oh, wait. We got flight. We don't need to actually pay attention to that. Good. I am glad. That would have been annoying. Oh, god damn it. So many of these pennies here. 
So we might be getting three random curses here. I don't think we've done 24 rooms or even close to it, to be honest. But we can only hope. Blue block, can you can you get out of the way? Oh, the blue blocks are scaring me. Spelunker's hat telling us the right way here. Lovely stuff. Lovely stuff. Extra bit of speed there, we like that. Eight seconds remain. Oh, why has it got to be this room? Why? What, 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 what exactly is it you, you think you're doing with your life? Did we get curses? I don't... The timer ran out, but nothing seemed to happen, so I don't really know. I am unsure. It doesn't seem like we gained three curses, so... Oh, Gorgon? Gorgon? Yeah, oh no, Big Chubby. Big Chubby and Gorgon look similar. Okay. Lop that down. Absolutely demolished. Dude, money-wise, we are sitting very, very pretty right now. I don't know why I just kind of stood there when there was uh, brimstones incoming, but I did. Three of clubs. Nice. 4.5 volt seems potentially good here. Although, that does mean it'll work that way for my... Not my Remnants as well, which isn't ideal. Didn't think about that implication there, did I? Big old troll bombs on the way towards me. Yeah, I didn't really think about the implications of Divine Remnants having to charge that way. So, not my best, not my best idea. Not my best. What's going to be in a secret room here? Ooh! Finally hit, but apparently that didn't actually take away my Holy Mantle, so... More fool you, I guess. Okay, let's try and open this up a good few times. Yeah, I don't think we're going to need all this money soon. Ooh, uh, I'm going to black rune this. See what we get. I think we gain damage out of that then. It's nice. Extra keys back for the ones that we just spent. Okay, I'm kill everything first. This is going surprisingly well. Surprisingly well. Almost too well. Try and use my bombs where I can because I've got golden bombs, but it's not the best when you fucking push them and they just go the wrong direction. Like, why does it go on an angle? Go straight. Pushed you straight, bomb. Go straight. Okay. Nice and easy kill on mum there. The devil deal is gonna be... Yes, please. Death's touch. We like that. Didn't even get a fire rate down for that. There's a heal spare there. We like heal spare. That would give us a ton of damage. We would gain a, a lot of damage being in here, but I don't think it's that worthwhile, to be honest. I think we just go... If only Black Rune could just suck them all up at once. Card reading is going to be nice here for a bit of skips. Um, Divine Remnants here to change this into another kind of mushroom. <laughs> just what I was looking for. Keeper's box. Oh god. I wa Oh, okay, I'm dead. <laughs> well, that was unexpected. I didn't realise there was an enemy underneath me there. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed another look into this character, and I will promise I'll play some other ones, maybe some of the tarnished characters in the next few episodes. But I hope you guys did enjoy, and I'll see you guys in the next one.